As we reported in last night's Finding Hope, nearly one in 10 Idaho high schoolers surveyed in 2017 say that they've attempted to take their own life. Clinical psychologist Gretchen Gundermanson says on top of creating open dialogue about suicide with kids and teens, parents should take every precaution to get rid of means of suicide in their home. Uh, that means making sure to safely lock up guns and ammunition separately and store medications and household toxins in a place where kids cannot easily access them. Most people who make a suicide attempt describe feeling ambivalent right up until that point. If something simply gets in the way, if there's some barrier put up to acting on an intense thought or acting on a plan that's made, that's going to help people weather the time, yeah. weather the intense emotion that they experience. You don't have to be suicidal to call the Idaho Suicide Prevention Hotline. It can be a good resource if you're concerned about a loved one. And for teenagers who want to reach out for themselves, you can also text the hotline Monday through Friday from 3 to midnight at the number on your screen. We also have it on 6onyourside.com under the finding of findinghope.com.